Hi, and welcome to Puzzle Pieces. In every episode, I try to give you a new idea or demonstrate a different technique that you can use to create your own puzzles. And in this episode, I want to look at a very general technique, but a very useful one, called letter indexing. Now that's when you have a number, and you use that number to count a certain number of letters into a word, or perhaps a certain number of letters into a line of text. And when you do that several times, the letters that you retrieve spell a word or phrase. Now for a puzzle like this to work, you need to have some agreed source that you're actually going to look up the index in. And perhaps the easiest example is just the alphabet itself. So if you assign a number to every letter of the alphabet in order, then provided a code like this, you could look up each letter and decode a message as follows. Now one of the ways to make a puzzle like this more interesting is instead of just having a sequence of numbers and looking up the characters at that position in the alphabet, think of novel ways in which you can communicate both the index numbers themselves and also the parts of text in which the characters need to be looked up. Fortunately, there's plenty of places where you can find examples of numbers and words appearing together in train timetables, bar menus, telephone directories, or the index of a book or map. So it's just a matter of choosing one which fits with the theme of your puzzle. Here's a few examples. 